So when I don't want him to watch TV with me, I pick shows that I know he doesn't like. <laughs> One of these shows is called Say Yes to the Dress. <laughs> I love Say Yes to the Dress. I love this show. If you haven't seen it, it's just a show about women trying on wedding dresses. That's it. That's all it is. They do have different locations. They have one in New York and one in Atlanta, so it's like wedding dress CSI. So... (laughs) The one in New York is at a place called Kleinfeld. It's very fancy. The one in Atlanta is at a place called Bridles by Lori. (laughs) <laughs> and it is owned by a woman named Lori Allen who I just love Lori Allen opened this store in 1980 12 days after she graduated from college 12 days after I graduated from college I was still hung over face down on the beach in Panama City, Florida <laughs> I didn't know what day it was, but I had an airbrushed t-shirt on that said, born to booze on there. (laughs) And Lori Allen was opening up her wedding dress store, which is now the most successful wedding dress store in the entire South. And here's why she's successful. She knows her business. She knows the industry. And she knows how to be nice to people that we would just smack right in the face. (laughs) Right? She, she's very nice. So here's how a typical episode works on Say Yes to the Dress. The bride comes in. Let's call her Brittany. Okay. <laughs> Brittany comes in, and she's got her mama and her grandmama and her aunt and two of her 18 bridesmaids. And they all come in, and the consultant says, well, what are you thinking today? And Brittany says, well, I'm thinking I want a mermaid fit and flare, and my budget is $37.25. And this is the first opportunity that Brittany should be smacked right in the face. But they don't do it. So they continue on. She tries on a bunch of dresses, and her people are all just mean to her. They're just mean to her about all the dresses. And then she finally finds one that she likes. And she comes out, and her mother goes, oh, no, that one is, nope, that's too bosomy. It's too bosomy, no. And her aunt goes, yeah, it's kind of revealing. And then her grandmother says, you look like a tramp. Which makes Brittany very sad. So she goes back, and she's kind of crying. But this is when Lori Allen goes into gear. She has a catchphrase, and she says, I'm going to jack her up. That's what she says. I'm going to jack her up, which means she's going to give Brittany wedding hair and wedding jewelry and a veil and a bouquet to hold. And so Brittany comes back out, and then the mama starts crying, and the aunt starts crying, the bridesmaids are crying, and the grandmama says, you know what, looks a whole lot less skanky with a veil on it. And then somehow Grandmama's credit card gets swiped through the machine at Lori Allen's and the dress is now $5,000. And then they all go to Panama City, Florida and they get airbrushed t-shirts that say born to booze on it. 